CataractCoach.com, what potential complication is hidden in plain view here? Look carefully, it's right there. I know, it's hard to tell. Let me show you the steps of the surgery. We'll edit this video so it's quick. Here's the main incision, and that looks great. That goes fine. No issues, well constructed. And here comes the capsular rexus. Again, that's completed without any issue at all. Nice, continuous, curvilinear, appropriate size, appropriate positioning. Everything looks great here. Even the nucleus removal and cortex removal, everything proceeds totally uneventfully. Here's the end of the case. Filling our bag with our viscoelastic. That's the cohesive viscoelastic. There's the outline of the rexus. Looks great. And we're going to put our lens in. Single piece acrylic lens. We're going to aim to put that right in the capsular bag. So fixate the eye. Here comes the lens. Start to deliver it. Great. Goes in the bag nicely. And we'll use our chopper here to help it unfold. And again, everything looks pretty normal. Looks like a routine case here. But there is a complication that's present even now, a potential complication that would require a return trip to the operating room. We don't want to do that. Watch carefully. Let's see what that is. Well, is it the haptic? No. We eventually opened that haptic up. It was stuck to the optic, but that's not it. Let's take out the viscoelastic. We'll go here towards the end. We'll get the IA probe on our high flow viscoelastic removal setting. Lift up the lens, go underneath the lens, remove the viscoelastic from the capsule bag, and we'll remove the viscoelastic from the anterior chamber as well. Our lens looks nicely centered up. The optic is overlapped by the capsule rexus. Moving the eye probe here around the eye to remove the viscoelastic. And we can see beautiful dilation, beautiful red reflex. Everything looks nice and clean, looks great. What could possibly be the issue here? I don't see anything at all yet. So let's uh, set up that lens. Time to seal the incisions. We'll just call the case done. So here comes our bounce salt solution on the blunt cannula. We'll go back and forth here to seal up the incision. Do you see the complication yet? Do you see the issue? Look carefully. It's not obvious. Now watch. As we go through the eye here and do a sweep of the angle... Wow, there's a tremendous amount of lens material still left, hidden in the angle with that viscoelastic. That's what was hidden in plain sight. If we didn't see that now, we'd have to come back tomorrow or the next day and aspirate that from the eye. We wouldn't want to leave it in there. So very important, we talked about it before, do the angle sweep at the end of the case to make sure there's no retained lens or viscoelastic.